Hello, well I'm with the Kent Bodgers today and actually a large number from the Sussex Bodgers as well. And we're going to be making a bench within a day, i.e. today, by sunset. And we're going to be using wood straight from the tree, a nice bit of chestnut. And we're going to be using hand tools only. Now this is a slightly bittersweet project because the bench is actually going to be a memorial bench for Phil, edge laying Phil. Yeah, the final tool is what I call a podger, uh, it's really just for hitting the stakes down at the end. Uh, as you can see it used to be a tree. Good. <laughs> Blacksmithing with the alpacas Phil. It's looking like it might be quite a challenge. <laughs> <Yes. laughs> Colcal in a day with Phil, guy you've seen on probably numerous other videos. Lovely guy, the guy with the loud shirts. Oh God, we're being oh. videoed. <laughs> so today we are making coracles, uh, two different types of coracle. Um, I've got a picture of one in here, um, the woven style. Um, we and John has designed, that's John as in the shingle film, a very nice bench. We're going to use chestnut and we're going to have it done by sunset. This is a tribute to Phil, lovely guy, and we want to do him proud. So good turnout, we will get going. We'll start by clefting out the back leg. We want everybody to make at least one piece from this bench and initial it on the back sides. Pretty straight there on that, that edge. So that's our datum really. So we can go down. And when you're doing this, do stand to the left of your axe because that is a danger. Okay? And then take this one off. Just the, just the edge. Like so. So I'm really pleased to have a Sussex group with us. Lots of them today. It's great. Rails for the sides, or one Rails. of them. All oh, right, so okay. There's going to be one each side. Yep. And there'll be similar things underneath, supporting the seat, ra seat rails <laughs> or whatever they are. I'm, I'm struggling with the terminology. <laughs> yes, I think we all we're all struggling a bit early in the morning. <laughs> I found the early start with a lack of coffee a bit challenging. Yeah. <laughs> We've got a volunteer on the two-man saw. Oh, come off it, there's a chainsaw somewhere. <laughs> that is the line we're going to be cutting along. What line? You can't see it, but it's there. It's the um, right, put your stick down. There's a few bits of debris on the ground behind you, so go easy. There's a handle there. Right, thank you. Move with your staff seat. You're pulling to the side a bit, so. Well done, gosh, that's quick. This is serious, you know. So I like your dowel plate because I had a go at Isn't it good? Yeah, making one of those. Yeah, it works really well. It's, it's nearly there. Excellent. That one's there, so we've got four on the go now. We've just four oh, yeah. finished Great. pegs. Oh nice. It's coming. I really want it. Do is make very long ones, then cut them up. Yeah. These are the side rails. Ah, yeah. yeah. So they've got to turn yeah. it into these. It's good we've got a nice showing of the Sussex Bodgers, isn't it, Andrew? It's... Well, Sussex Bodgers <laughs> or, or Best Bodgers? Oh. <laughs> very good. <laughs> I, Phil always liked a bit of uh, inter county. Uh, 
camaraderie. Yes, it's a nice bit of so, friendly rivalry, yeah, exactly. isn't it? It's in the yeah. best possible way. Absolutely, yeah. No, no um, hard feelings or... or <laughs> no. Or <laughs> Unless we're turning chair legs. <laughs> well, dogs no. leg racing, that's, that's entirely different. Absolutely. <laughs> yes, it's a bit awkward. Um, you persevere and get in there. Yeah, yeah, no, certainly are. Hi, right, Colin, what part is oh, yeah. this? It's a back slot, I believe. Oh. <laughs> That's the plan. Yeah, good, good stuff. Not too bad. Not too bad. Good. They're not toasted. <laughs> no. Well, hopefully it's knocking a bit of moisture out them anyway. <laughs> is that the rear leg? Oh. Yeah, there's one I've roughed out already over the ah, area. Good stuff. Um, they've got me back on the axe again. <laughs> yes, well, you're, you're the master of the axe. But yeah, so it's just a case of trying to keep the shape yeah. where the pencil lines are, yeah. get it rough to the, that dimension and then thin it out from that. So, um, Probably being a curved part of the grain. Not very easy, is it? Weight, so. Okay. So that nail, is it out? out or yes, is it? it's gone, yes. Yeah, but it managed it, presumably to chip your draw knife nicely, um, or I not too bad. Probably I have. It's annoying when that happens. It is, but there we go. But it was a just a fine slice, so I might have just gone through the rust. Oh, it's been a tricky old piece. <laughs> a nice knot at the top for you to there. grapple with, but it looks good. You, you've got it smooth, haven't you? Robin, you got a bit there without the woodworm? <laughs> yes, I have, yeah. Yeah, but get rid good. of the woodworm. Good idea to introduce it into a new bench. Oh <laughs> no. Got yourself a nice cover on your axe. Yeah, I'm right. Yeah, it's nice there. Right. Yeah, lovely. Right. This is a front leg. Front leg, good. It's big, isn't it? it it's a lot bigger than it needs to be because we've dropped it by half an inch, which makes it a lot more hard work. Isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> uh, we will start with one side, then we'll match up the other side, and then we'll put all the cross rails in and the seat slat, so everybody can get involved in their part by forming their tenant. That's fine, from here, it's looking good. Getting the stuff out. Yeah. yeah. The is not clean, but... And then chisel. I've put on my bright stuff just for Phil. That's great, very good. I'm getting warm now, though. <laughs> I know, yes, good tribute. At the moment, when you get that central, that's quite a reasonable slope on the back. 30 years old and I... It's 1871 that one. I've been able to date it. <laughs> yeah. Probably well, quicker to clean up with a chisel now, won't it? Yeah. The mark here where we can trim them off. Right, now how much overlap have you got? I've got five inches, four inches, four inches. This is tea, I take it. Bacon and eggs. Yeah. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> it was meant to be lunch, so I only, only did one of them for lunch. That's good now, that reference point for you. Sorry. That mallet? Oh, 
Do you want to christen it, John? Yeah, come on, John. Yeah, yeah come on, designer, John. Designer. Where have you got? There you are. Yep. Smile, oh. Churchill, leap of victory. Excellent. Well done, John. Right for the camera. They did that one on the chair in the day, didn't you? <laughs> yes. <laughs> come on, Phil. Come on, everybody's got to have at least one try. Everybody sit on it, come on. Careful. Now don't, 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 don't take the mickey. There's always one. Look. Do a selfie. <laughs> the way your legs swing on it, it makes you feel like Bumps a kid at the barbers. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he's always up the top. He's going to leave two on. Right. Head up. Smile. Yeah, smile. Fantastic. It's, yeah. it's comfort, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. It's <laughs> Perfect. Take the lights. Keep the light over. You're, you've been on it, Colin? Yeah, it's good. It's nice for the bounce. It's not bad, is it? It's not, it's, no. It's, it's kind of hopefully not going to have right. Now, can we, can we have a communal one? <laughs> Should we say three cheers for Phil? Yeah. Hip hip! Hip hip! Hip hip! Hip hip! One for luck! Hip hip! <laughs>